In this video, I will show you how to get fingerprint lock on any Android device. Thank you for watching, and if you feel this video helpful, then please like and share this video. First of all, open your Google Play Store, and then search ICE Unlock Fingerprint Scanner. Install the first one. This app has 1 million downloads and good review rate. This app uses real biometrics that use your finger to unlock your Android device. Now open the app. Read the agreement carefully and then tick mark on I accept the agreement. And then tab on Let's go. Now you need to create PIN password for secondary option with fingerprint lock. Type PIN again to confirm. Now take a look how this app works. Now tab on continue to enroll for create fingerprint lock. Select the finger to scan. Now scan your finger through your phone camera. Use rear camera to scan. When you scan your finger, then don't move your finger and camera until it's scanned successfully. Tab on use this fingerprint. This is icon setting page where you can add or remove fingerprint. You can edit or create pin. Now tab on home button to use ice lock. Select ice unlock and then tab on always button. This allow ICE Unlock to function as a security screen replacement. Now, when you going to unlock your phone, it will redirect to the ICE Unlock fingerprint screen, where, you need to scan your finger and verify it to unlock. If you scan other finger then it's not validate. Tab here to unlock phone through pin password. There are some points you need to know before using this app. This app requires a rear-facing camera with flash, and the camera has to be able to focus on finger. Some device do not focus on close objects, so in that case, this app may not work properly for that type of device. Thank you for watching. Please comment below if you have any question or suggestion on how to get fingerprint lock on Android device. If you like this video. Please give us thumbs up and share this video. If you don't subscribe our channel, please subscribe to our channel to get more updates.